Hi everyone, and welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to be talking about Apple GPT, which is a new AI technology that Apple is using in its products. I'll be discussing what Apple GPT is, its features, and some things to look out for. By the end of the video, we'll talk about an amazing feature, so stay until the end. What is Apple GPT? Apple GPT stands for Generative Pre-Trained Transformer. It's a type of large language model, or LLM, the framework known as AJAX, that's been trained on a massive data set of text and code. This allows Apple GPT to generate text, translate languages, write different kinds of creative content, and answer your questions in an informative way. With their experience and shortcomings in Apple's Siri, the company is inclined to work until they reach perfection. In that pursuit, the company has brought John Gianandrea, a former Google employee. Features of Apple GPT Apple GPT has a number of features that make it a powerful AI technology. These include Large language model Apple GPT is trained on a massive dataset of text and code, which gives it a deep understanding of language. This allows it to generate text that is both accurate and creative. Multilingual. Apple GPT can understand and generate text in multiple languages. This makes it a valuable tool for international communication. Answer questions. Apple GPT can answer your questions in an informative way. It can access and process information from the real world through Google search, and it can use this information to provide you with accurate and up-to-date answers. Generate creative content. Apple GPT can generate different kinds of creative content, such as poems, code, scripts, musical pieces, emails, letters, etc. This makes it a valuable tool for writers, artists, and programmers. Things to look out for. While Apple GPT is a powerful technology, there are a few things to keep in mind. These include bias. Apple GPT is trained on a massive dataset of text and code, which means it may reflect the biases that are present in that dataset. This is something to be aware of when using Apple GPT, and it's important to be critical of the results that it produces. Privacy. Apple GPT is a cloud-based service, which means that your data is stored on Apple's servers. This raises some privacy concerns, as you need to trust Apple to keep your data safe. Accuracy. Apple GPT is still under development, which means that its accuracy can vary. It's important to be aware of this when using Apple GPT and to double check the results that it produces. Waves of change. Recently, Meta, formerly known as Facebook, released its large language model, Llama 2. Meta partnered with Microsoft to make Llama 2 commercially accessible. Qualcomm is on the move to implement Llama 2's AI on its phones and PCs next year. Apple's Ajax and Apple GPT are working on making these AI chatbots a worthy contender in the next year. Who do you think would be better? Is this changing landscape of technology and our lives overwhelming you, or are you changing with the tide? Now it's time for the bonus feature. Apple is adamant about working on privacy concerns. They want to make sure the user is at ease with the privacy concerns. Users, especially organizations, are skeptical about the chat history stored at ChatGPT and Bard services. Apple intends to ensure that users get the best experience with complete privacy. According to Tim Cook, the company is keen on making sure the AI chatbots align with the company's brand identity and provide the user with complete privacy with the best experience. We all know Apple GPT is a powerful AI technology that has a lot of potential. However, it's important to be aware of its limitations and to use it responsibly. I hope this video has given you a better understanding of Apple GPT. Thanks for watching and improving, dear viewers. Remember to click the like button, subscribe, and ring the YT bell icon to stay updated.